What's going on? It's Casey from casey-sounds.com. So today's video, I'm going to talk about how you as a music producer or music artist can build your fan base. I'm going to give you five tips on how you can build your fan base. Tip number one, Instagram posts, Instagram stories and hashtag all combined in one. So with your Instagram posts, you want to be consistent with your posts. Post your music, post your beats, but try not to be too confusing with your posts. Try and keep it consistent. Have a theme if you if that's your sort of thing. All the other stuff that you're doing behind the scenes. This is where your Instagram stories come into play. So you think about it, your Instagram posts are like your finished article, your finished product. And then your Instagram stories is all the behind the scenes of how you got to that final product. You know what I'm saying? Use your stories to post what you've been eating, just your life. So it's kind of like just creating that content rather than giving that final product. So it can be what you're eating, you go and gym, go and shopping, whatever it is you do in, in your in-between times, post that. Also, what you can do is put hashtags in there so you can create more reach. So relevant hashtags. And all this is going to do is get more eyes onto your profile, on, onto you and your brand and what you're doing. So this will build you up and get you to a point of like, when you start releasing stuff, people will will support you tip number two as a music artist what you need to start doing is cover songs start doing cover songs because if you're going to put out original songs no one knows about you so the chances are you, no one's going to really pay much attention to you because at the end of the day that's all you're trying to do is getting people's attention if you're putting out cover songs and they're good and you're posting them on youtube you can also post that onto your instagram as well so you're crossing platforms which is something that you need to do then this will help to build your brand build your fan base beat makers do remixes songs that are popping do remix put it on your youtube do remakes same again put it on your instagram put it in your stories like how you're getting to that point of making it what samples you're using if you use samples what instruments what sounds and um, what's inspiring you do you know what i'm saying so if you're putting that all together on your youtube channel and then posting that on your instagram as well that's more exposure just gaining that attention from people watching uh, watching what you're doing tip number three get big in your local area music artist find producers in your area that are creating or producing the sounds that you like reach out to them collab with them or buy the beats that they, they're making if they're selling them and just create a buzz in your local area so you can also use those songs that you've made and some cover songs and go and do open mic nights or just hit up some networking events there's, there's always some kind of event if you go into eventbrite.com type in um, networking events for music I'll put a link in the description below find these networking events go there talk to people uh, exchange details instagram emails whatever you, your contact details are create a buzz that way you don't have to, you can go to another city if you want but what i'm trying to say at first build that buzz in your local area and then branch out same same for us beat makers i'm, I'm gonna call producers for, for argument's sake same for us go to eventbrite put in producer events there's always some kind of a, a producer events producer producer events find where they are in your local area go down there showcase what you do network talk to like-minded people and that should grow your fan base tip number four you just got to be consistent you've got to you've got to keep going you've got to keep even when you don't feel like doing it you've got to do it do you know what i'm saying because it's this is your career we're talking about this is your brand do you know what i'm saying it's not always a case of oh i don't feel like doing it today like you've got to change that mindset how i look at things or what i tell my boys is whenever you're there chilling playing Fortnite, and them other little ballers are out there practicing i don't know if that's the case i know they're probably on Fortnite as well but that's what i tell them and that's the mindset you need to have do you know what i mean so if you ain't got that mindset don't force it do you know what i mean if you're one of them that likes to chill play computer games or procrastinate and that's up to you it's all about being self-aware i'm not going to sit here and say i don't procrastinate because i do i like to play i do sometimes i like to play fifa do you know what i mean um but i also put the work in do you know what i'm saying so yeah work rate and consistency so yeah and tip number five is kind of going back to the instagram posts so for producers use the promo ads that are on instagram there's plenty of them out there there's ones with a decent size following all you need to do hit them up in their dm <laughs> and they'll give you a price on what what their promo ads are i've used them before it works it's all about just gaining attention it's all about people just seeing what you do to build your brand you know what i'm saying so find pages that do promos that will post your your you making beats or your beats 
I don't know if I've seen any beat video ones, if I'm honest. But yeah, definitely, if you if you make, like making beats, you're in front of the camera, or you've got something that you want to show and or be reposted, then that's the way forward. Same with music artists. Put a search in unsigned talent, hashtag unsigned talent, um, new heat, them sort of hashtags, and find them promo pages. Plenty of them out there. Hit them up, give them a video for them to repost, and yeah that would definitely help to gain some more exposure for you don't be shy in spending a little so just find what works for you in your within your budget once you start building that fan base then you can start putting out all the music all your original stuff now you've got the ears and the eyes on your on your page and and uh, you're building that fan base so you can be a bit more confident when you're, you're putting out your original work i hope this video has helped these five tips hope it's made sense if it hasn't just drop a comment below and i'll i'll get back to you or just hit me up on instagram and we can chop it up on there if this video has helped at all hit the like button hit the subscribe button don't forget to hit the notification bell so you get notified anytime i put up a new video as per usual i appreciate your time thank you for watching music is life peace